Mistake number one, fighting in front of employees. I remember a couple. They are my close friends. They always fight in front of their employees when they disagree on something. Sometimes the husband approves something and then the wife disagrees. And so they fight. Or sometimes the wife approves something that the husband doesn't want. And so they disagree. Big fights. It was so bad. They'd shout at each other. The wife would throw stuff at her husband. And the employees are there watching them fight. And because of this, the husband became disrespected by their employees. Whatever he says or tells them what to do, the employees would just wait for the wife to make the final decision. You know, employees are wise, just like our parents. Even if there's no fighting, we would go to the parent who we think is most likely to allow us to get our way, right? Yes, we did this to our parents. If we need more money for our allowance or to get permission to go on a trip with friends, we go to the parent who is more giving or who is easier to say yes, right? And then the parent who approves becomes an ally. And together, we are now up against the parent who initially said no. Now, if you have kids, you will also observe this with your kids. We as parents are played by our kids like a ping pong or table tennis. They play us so that we are made to go head to head with each other. Yes, just like what we did to our parents, our kids and employees will make us fight. So again, the lesson here is do not fight in front of them. Always appear to be united. I know it's hard, but if you make the decision that you will never fight in front of them, you won't. My husband and I, we've been together in business for more than 40 years, but we never, not even once, fought in public. We never fought in front of our kids or our employees, but we are human. And so, did we fight? Of course, we fought often, especially when we did not know any better. Yes, just like most couples, we often disagreed with each other's decisions. But one thing that kept us together was the agreement to present a united front to others. 